The graph of cosine to find values and we've got the graph restricted from 0 to 2 pi so we include the 0 but not the 2 pi because there's not an equal sign under there so um, this is a good way to know your values uh, for especially these are the quadrandal type angles pi over 2 pi 3 pi over 2 and 2 pi so at negative 1, we only have one value from 0 to um, 2 pi, and that would be x equals pi. Because at negative 1, we're at pi. Now at 1, we have actually two values. We have x equals 0, and here we have the x equals 2 pi, but we can't use it because it can't it can't equal right here. That just is less than. It can't equal it. So we basically only have one value. And at zero, we have uh, two values here at zero. So uh, remember, this is your y value here. So at zero, we have x equals pi over 2. And we also have x equals 3 pi over 2. Okay, and the next one is your sine. Now in sine, they want you to find values from negative 2 pi to 0. So they only want to include negative 2 pi, but not the 0. Therefore, let's just answer this. We're only working on the left side here and not on the right. So where sine is 1 is right here. So that would be x, let me do a different color, let's choose green. So x equals negative 3 pi over 2. And at negative 1, right here, that would be x equals negative pi over 2. And at 0, which would be right in here, we have x equals negative 2 pi and x equals negative pi. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.